Back again with another uh, quick MSI Wind uh, Geek Cast or whatever you want to call it. Uh, today I think I'm just going to quick give you a demo of my uh, Full OS X uh, setup I have now. Uh, I got my Dell Wi-Fi card in, so I have a full portable MacBook right now. Um, and uh, also I got the VMware Fusion running and also put the GarageBand on here too, just to see how that ran. There we go. So far it's pretty cool, you know, being able to actually use the Wi-Fi. It makes my uh, OS X install a little more usable then too, since uh, having to use a network cable is kind of annoying when you have a laptop. And I actually physically removed the one riser that's in the middle on the motherboard itself. Uh, that way I didn't have to insulate it and actually short out the first card I got too. So just a heads up. Also got the my display working properly. Sleep works great. Um, Here you'll notice we have our Wi-Fi airports on. Working nicely. Let's see, you got Firefox going. And uh, I actually uh, set up my spaces too, so I don't know how many other people really use them, but let's see what we got in here. So, let's see here. Not a bad connection actually Wi-Fi wise, so it's always cool. And then we got uh, the only downfall with the uh, GarageBand is that it uh, doesn't fit in the display. It's too big. The program doesn't downsize to the 1024 by 600 uh, resolution, so sucks. Um, but that's kind of cool, you know, be able to mess around with a little some tracks, or whatever. I myself like uh, the whole keyboard. I think that's always cool. Because you can do like music typing. So, fun, fun. Um, finally, I'll show you VMware Fusion running. I'm going to show you XP running within OS X. Whoa, brain implosion. Uh, the version of XP that I saw the course was a custom version I created for my VM machine. Um, basically, I use NLight to uh, make a clean custom version, you know, removing crap I didn't need, doing the registry hacks and all that good stuff. Um, it runs pretty decent. It's not too bad. Considering the fact that, you know, you're running an OS within an OS on a little netbook or whatever, running a 1.6 Atom processor, so. Wish it did, uh, wish the motherboard did support more memory. So, we'll just wait for this thing. I'm, oh, wait, I must have been in hibernation. Um, you can use Unity too. Uh, I'll show you that too. It's kind of cool. Of course, my display now is too small. Wait, you There we go. So basically, yeah, it's, I mean, you could theoretically run XP within OS X, I think, you know. So, you know, you're tunneling your internet in from your OS X if you have an internet connection. So if I need to use IE, I can use it within here. 
Um, the cool thing, of course, you know, is the unity, the stuff that everyone talks about. However, though, when you're in here, Okay, now, here's how the kind of cool thing is. I now have, you know, you have my computer, you can do run separately. It's like running Windows within OS X as part of the OS. It's kind of cool. And prove that this is actually a wind. Yay. So. That was some funness uh, with the OS X and uh, VMware Fusion. Um, I've been able to use Office 2004 fine in here too. Uh, Adobe seems to actually run even on here. Not the best, of course, you know. But it runs. So, with that, I peace.